Hi, Mina san. Welcome back to the channel. It's me, Abby Kareen, your Philly neighborhood nerd, and we are back with Ranking of Kings. This one is called The Footsteps of War. Makes sense, because literally the war is coming to that poor kingdom. The kingdom, actually, I don't know what this kingdom is called. We're just gonna jump into this because I need to find out more about Miranjo. Like her character is confusing the F out of me and I just need to know her evil schemes. I need to know. So let's jump in, make sure my boy Boji is good because he's also, he's writing with obviously Kage and like the cap, the captain and the crew um, of, of Desha's land, but like, they don't seem like they're up to any good too. It seems like, no, cause yeah, Desha told them to, to, this is our chance to take the kingdom of Boss. So it's just like, they know they're gonna have to essentially betray Boji. What? If you'd like to check out the full reaction to this episode, you can find it on my Patreon. There we are about three weeks ahead. Don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe and follow me on the social media. Let's do this. <laughs> And do, don't y'all just love that? Like, Kage was just this hurt soul who, like, became a bully and then he found, like, a true friend. And look how happy he is. Look how supportive he is because he found a family. Like, that's all, that's all it is, y'all. Everyone's gonna find somebody. Oh, it's a new intro! Sorry. <laughs> Everyone's expecting my... <gasps> I am falling in love. I liked this anime before, but I am so, this is so magical. Oh, I am just so in love with this. The broken mirror. Goddamn boss. I wanna hate boss so bad, but goddamn if, if... <laughs> don't, don't look like that. Don't, who's got her entrapped? Who's that? Who, what? Her, her, Kuro, Bebin, Snakes, Beep. I love this intro. What? Where is he going now? Look, he's he's gonna travel so much. Oh my god, the show, not the show breaking me, not it breaking every. <laughs> Was, the intro was fantastic. Oh, I'm about to rewatch that one. Thank God I'll get to, but oh man. Oh, <laughs> I don't see. I'd be like, no, I don't like a mysterious bitch. I don't want to deal with it. A piece, and you're just fine with them just, just, just destroying your kingdom. I just don't understand. I don't understand. God. She's crystal. She's a diamond. A piece, I don't want you dying. Just go home, baby. Just, I don't understand. You, these guys are so tough. Oh yeah, cause she's diamond. Duh, she's fine. They're so smart. Oh shit. She's got a lot of them. I didn't realize she had so much. She might take over this country. She might just do it. <laughs> what happened to the horse? No! What happened to the horse? Is that he's just taking a long time because his horse is fat? Oh, he just wants to be a 
Oh, well, that's a faithful horse. <laughs> oh my gosh, and he's so into it. He's so happy. <laughs> Get the F out of the way. <laughs> Run this It's just gonna take a long time. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is King Boss not strong enough to take on these guys? That doesn't make sense to me. This does not make sense. He's still strong. He still has his strength, right? Oh my god. I want the nice shiny <laughs> crown. It's mine. <laughs> so dumb. You're in my seat. I don't trust that one. I don't trust that. That one I don't trust. Okay. <laughs> he had those thick thighs he had to make room for. <laughs> Relatable. <laughs> Here he comes. Is that is that what they wanted just for them to fight each other? Freeze, bitch. Is he Father Time? Is he the the Knight of Time? Damn. He's like, nope, you gonna suffer? You gonna suffer, son? <laughs> Let's not mess with this one. He's gonna sit and watch him. He's, a, he's gonna, oh, go and he's swinging over there. He's swinging. <laughs> Dude, just leave him alone. Let him just have his moment. He just wants to watch. <laughs> Cut throat. That looks like the guy that was dancing in the woods. Did that not look like the, and he had a crown. Was that him? <sighs> Can we get him like a wipe tissue? They are so cut. They are cutthroat. There is so much happening right now. Gosh. <laughs> Back for round two. That's a mirror that your son had to deal with. Yeah, you got I want her to do I want Queen Hilling to smash that mirror. So you're just being petty. Bevan, not. Well, I guess Bevan's entering the match too. But oh, he's just taking a stroll and saw this dead man. Did his hand move? Was he, was he actually the, what? Okay. Oh, look at this too. This is so pretty. Oh, so I wanted to watch the, the ending. Uh, it was very cute. First of all, that intro was awesome. I was very inspired by that intro. Um, that was a good one. The song was, oh yeah, yeah, okay. Well, things, <clears throat> well, things are just moving along. Um, everything's kind of rounded back to the castle. And I, I, I guess I'm a bit confused because it's just like, Miranjo's saying that she wants to bring the, the, the castle, the kingdom to ruin. But she seems so in love with King Boss, so it's just like, is she trying to free him from 
this responsibility of a kingdom so they can go off and do whatever they want? Or do, does she resent him and is mad at him for like getting married and having another kid? I don't know. Some interesting stuff. I just, I just, because at first I thought she was like, um, this one character, Doki, which is from a, uh, anime called Soul Hunter. Not Soul Eater, it's called Soul Hunter. It's a really, really old one, and it had, like, this guy, I think his name was, like, Taikabo, and he rode around on Hippopotamus. But anyway, it's, like, set in, like, feudal Japan or whatever, and so, what, the, the main antagonist is this woman, a spell enchantress woman, who, like, takes over like the kingdom the king's mind like she controls him so she can controls the uh, kingdom and like you know people are suffering and all this so it's just like that's what kind of what i thought her character was like like oh she just wants to like be in the king's ear and love only him and then like rule the kingdom in misery but i it seems she just wants everyone to suffer so it's just like we really need to get her backstory because from i think it was the last episode when dida was in the the darkness of doom and despair you know the victims of the child miranjo is like no she did this she came here but but that but that scenario could also be you know misleading because like maybe they just she was just different and they were like you're different so we're gonna kill you as a witch and then like that happened so it, there's so many ways this can go and and so i'm trying to <laughs> Like, maybe the whole kingdom was built on a whole lie. Like, the blood of, of Miranjo. I don't know. I don't know. So, we will have to see. It's very interesting, though. I, I like this mystery. Even though I do not like her, I do like this mystery of what's going to be happening. And, um, but it just seems like we're going to get into some type of fight. Uh, I just need Despa to get there on his fat horse. <laughs> Anyone else living for that? Just Despa on a fat horse? <laughs> It's great. All right, but I'm going to stop. Um, hopefully I'll get to watch another one soon. But <laughs> thank you so much for watching, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.